Have you ever wondered on how to solve a Rubik's Cube? Well today I will show you on how to solve the first two layers on a Rubik's Cube. So the next part will be upcoming in the next few days. There will I show on how to solve the upper part of the Rubik's Cube. So this is this is a Rubik's Cube and it has six sides. One, two, three, four five and six. Every side has a middle part. This middle part shows which color is on the side. So for example here is orange, then this side must be orange at the end. It's pretty simple. So and you have to know that orange is on the opposite side from red, green is on the opposite side from blue, and yellow from the, on the opposite side from white. So to solve a Rubik's Cube you first have to do a cross with the edges on one side you choose. I already chose white because I choose white every time. So yeah every side has four edges and four corners and you have to find the four edges that are have to color white on them. So for example here is white, so this is perfect already. You see this is not right. So you have to watch. Oh there is blue. But here is blue. What do we do? Of course we just do this and it's on the right side. So the next step is to look. Oh here is white and it has to go somewhere here. But I don't know where. Well you see blue and white. This has green and white. That means green is on the opposite from blue. So blue is here, green is here. That means this piece has to go there because green is here. So to do this you have to, if it's not right, you have to rotate once to the green part. It can also happen on the other side. So once and up. So it's not very hard, just two steps. If it's not right, but already next to the side where it belongs, just do one down to the side and up. So now we have two. Now we look again and see here's another one again. So here's white and orange. Orange is here, so this is pretty simple again. You see, blue is here, orange is there. That means orange is on the right side from blue. So to do this edge onto this side, on there, you have to rotate this once. So you can make it on the right to the blue. So again, you have blue here and on the right to blue, on the right side. Is orange. So you turn it one away, it to this and back. So it's on the right because if you don't turn it back you just scramble it around. So you have to turn it one time, do it there so it's on the right side and back. Pretty simple. Okay now we watch and we see there's nothing that has a white color. So we turn the cube and see oh here's the last one. It's already in a perfect position because it, the white white side is up. It's looking up. So we see it's already on the right color so we don't have to rotate it to the right color. And then we just do because white is on the opposite of yellow and it's up just two times. So from the other perspective two times. So it's down here. And then we finish. It can also happen that this white piece is not looking up but to the side. So first thing is to look what color is next to the white on this edge. You see green so you have to put it there. So if it's like right here, 
we have first put it there so you know it belongs there because green is here so first step is so you can to do this there the first step is to do it left or right it's the same thing so for example if I do left I have to rotate this to the next side to the side where it has to go so there's green it has to go to green so you have to rotate it to the next side next to it you can do it on the left or right I will show both so to the left it will look like this and then you turn it down this one time down so it goes there and this goes up so we don't break anything because if not there's this red piece so now from the right you can also do it from the right side so you turn it away so you can turn it down so it's perfect do it down and this up again so we don't break anything and that's it and if it's right here and it's wrong you can just rotate it twice so it's up there and do the same thing I just showed so for example like I showed like to the right down this down and up again if you have everything here white but two are wrong I can show you how to solve it so you put them down and you see one is wrong and the other one is wrong on the opposite opposite side so they have to switch first thing you do is to do this to the opposite side to the yellow for example because i have white both to the opposite side so they are both now there then you rotate them two times so they are right here and do them down again you can do them down like this this front side to the right two times or to the left it's the same thing if you turn the cube two times it's pretty simple because you can do it on the right or left side it's the same thing and this too down down you can basically do this with everything I can show you one other example for example if these two are wrong not on the opposite side but next to it it's the same thing just do them two times up so they're on the other side now you know oh they're looking up so you just do one so it's on the right right color and do two times down and then the next one orange white orange is here we do this and up the, on the opposite side where you want to solve it you just do it two times or like this it's the same thing and now we are finished with the cross so now that we finished the white cross we can do the edges on the sides next to the white because we want to finish two layers we don't do the white side first because we want to put the edges on the right spot and then do the corners there so you see first thing is you look if there's any edge on the up layer on the upside which is not with a yellow color so for example here is yellow orange so this belongs on the up we don't use it but here's orange blue that means there's no yellow so we use it so orange blue where it belongs is pretty simple you look orange blue so you can do it like this that this looks up and not here to the blue and make this up right down you can also do it like this you put the orange to the right spot and you know blue goes there so you do it down this away not up 
but away like down this up again and up you can do this trick with almost everything actually with every edge so it's pretty easy you look again green orange here's green orange so you put it there this goes up right down or you can do it like this you put it on the right spot where it belongs green down down up up so this is pretty simple then we look if there's any left and yes there is one left so we look this is not the right side. Blue, red. Here's orange, green. That's not right. Green, red. No, because it's blue, red. So this one side where blue, red, it belongs there. You see this? It already is with the corner, so it's even easier to solve. You just make it down, down, up, up. It can also happen that this edge is twisted, not on the right, it's on the right place, but twisted. So you do it up, put it away, it's doesn't, it doesn't matter in which direction, and down. And now we have it alone here, and you can do the same thing again. Up, left, down. Also, you can do it from there down down up up i just showed the right side if it's there but also it can be left so this goes then up first this to the right and not left and down so it's the same thing but not left but right so if you finish the edge pieces like me you have to watch for the corners that have a white color so you see it has a white color, so that means you have to look for orange and blue. Here's orange, there's blue. So we turn it there. So now you see, blue is already correct. But the others two have to go there. It has to go there because white is there. That's what we want to do. So on this step, if blue is already right, you have to turn it to the right, this up, this upper layer to the right, this down, turn it two times, it doesn't matter which direction, turn it up again, right and down. It's a pretty hard step, I will show it again. So. Now we see it's a white corner again, but this time red and green. So we look, oh, green, red, that's right. So we turn it there and see, oh, it's the same thing again. On the right side, it's right. So we do it again. To the right, this up, this upper layer to the right, down, Turn it two times, do it up, right, down. So after that we look again and see, oh, white and orange green, green, orange. Now we have to put it there to the green orange edge. And see, it's not on the right this time, but on the left, it's from the color right. So now we do this, like this. We turn it to the left, not to the right. Turn it up. Turn it to the right. Turn it down. Turn it two times. Turn this side again, up again, put it there in, and down. So, 
this is how you finish it but i also show you other examples for example if the white color is not on the left or right and these are not matching that means the white color has to be up there and if it's up there and has to go there you have to do this up this upper layer left down up a layer to the right and two times more up left down right up left down right so now that you finished you will see on the next part how to solve the last layer of the cube but it could also happen that these are wrong so they are not in the right position but they are already not up here but down there you have to do the same thing again as I showed you do it up left down right up left down right up left down right so now it's not down there but there and now you can see oh they don't match that means white is up there if they match i showed how to solve it so you can do it with practice you can do it even faster so this is just to show you how to do it because this trick with up left down right belongs to the next part too i will show it there too up left down right up left down right so now we finished the first two layers so if you have any questions please ask in the comments and yeah see you in the next part